Thomas Shelby, the iconic character from the drama series Peaky Blinders, is remembered for his intelligence, calmness, and sharp thinking. There are several thinking techniques that can be learned from Thomas Shelby. 1. Thinking ahead, strategic. His analytical thinking style and ability to always be several steps ahead of his opponents not only formed the basis of his diverse business successes but also ensured the safety of himself and his family from various life-threatening situations. A typical example of Thomas Shelby's strategic thinking strategy can be seen in how he handles conflicts with other groups. Shelby always conducts in-depth research on his opponents, identifies weaknesses, and uses that information for personal or family gain. He never rushes into decisions. Each step is calculated, demonstrating forward thinking. Positive examples of his strategic thinking skills can be applied in the business world. Like Shelby, one must be able to look further ahead in business, predict market changes, and plan strategies to address them. This includes product innovation, market diversification, or even internal restructuring to remain relevant and competitive. Another positive application is in conflict resolution. By understanding the interlocutor or competitor, just as Shelby delves into the character and motives of his opponents, one can seek solutions beneficial to both parties, avoid unnecessary confrontations, and build bridges for future cooperation. 2. Seeing opportunities in problems. Instead of lamenting difficulties, he sees them as opportunities. We can learn a lot from Shelby's way of thinking, especially in facing everyday challenges. For example, when Shelby faces rival gangs or complex business situations, he doesn't just look for a way out. He ponders, how can I get out of this situation while gaining more benefits? It's not about blind optimism, but about changing perspective. Every problem is an opportunity to grow, learn, or gain advantage. In real life, we can apply Shelby's way of thinking. Take, for example, a situation at work. Perhaps you're faced with a project with a very tight deadline. Instead of stressing and losing focus, ask yourself, how can I use this situation to improve my time management skills or demonstrate leadership? Or in personal situations, let's say you lose your job. Sure, it's a scary situation, but on the other hand, it could be a golden opportunity to rethink your actual career aspirations, perhaps start your own business, or learn new skills you've always dreamed of. Applying Shelby's way of thinking in these examples allows us to not only navigate difficulties more effectively, but also to achieve better results from initially unfavorable situations. It's about seeing the bigger picture and not being afraid to take bold steps, with careful consideration of course. So adopting the seeing opportunities in problems attitude of Thomas Shelby not only makes us tougher in facing problems. More than that, this way of thinking opens the door to unexpected personal and professional growth. So, when faced with obstacles, ask yourself what hidden opportunities can be seized and take inspiration from Shelby's calmness and cleverness in every step you take. 3. Prioritizing logic over emotion Prioritizing logic over emotion doesn't mean that Thomas Shelby doesn't have feelings or isn't influenced by them. Instead, he chooses not to let emotions dictate his decisions. For example, in negotiations or conflicts, Shelby appears to take a step back, assesses the situation from a broader perspective, and then makes logical decisions that are best for his business or family. This helps him stay ahead of his opponents. A positive example of applying this principle in our lives is in conflict situations or decision making. When faced with difficult situations, we often let emotions take over which may lead us to make less objective or even detrimental decisions. By applying Thomas Shelby's way of thinking, one can learn to hold back emotions momentarily, evaluate all options logically, and then choose the most advantageous or least harmful path for all parties involved. Of course, this doesn't mean that we should completely ignore emotions. Emotions are an important part of the human experience and play a key role in understanding personal values and empathy toward others. However, the balance between emotion and logic, as demonstrated by Shelby, can lead to more informative, strategic decisions and ultimately, wiser ones. So, 
The lesson we can take from Thomas Shelby is the importance of finding a balance between logic and emotion. This principle can be applied in various aspects of life, such as career decision-making, interpersonal relationships, and even in facing everyday problems. Thus, we can make more mature decisions and think long-term, similar to how Shelby plans his movies in the power game and survival in post-World War I Birmingham 4, Adaptation and Learning, his way of adapting and learning from every situation inspires many to apply it in real life. One key to Shelby's success is adaptation. He quickly recognizes changes in trends and social dynamics, then adjusts his business strategies to remain relevant. For example, during the Prohibition era in the US, Shelby saw an opportunity and switched from horse bedding to illegal alcohol imports. This teaches us the importance of flexibility and the ability to adapt to unexpected changes. Learning from experience is another foundation of Shelby's way of thinking. He's not afraid to make mistakes, but more importantly, he learns from them. Every failure is a lesson not to be repeated in the future. An application example in our lives might be in a professional or personal context. We can learn to take calculated risks, but when the outcome is not as expected, we should analyze what went wrong, learn from it, and not repeat the same mistakes. Applying Shelby's way of thinking about adaptation and learning can be very positive. In the workplace, for example, an adaptive attitude can keep us relevant and thriving even when faced with constantly changing technology. Personally, this attitude teaches us not to fear change and failure because both are part of the learning and growing process. So Thomas Shelby teaches us to always be adaptive and learn from every experience. This is a way to move forward, both in our careers and personal lives. By adopting these two principles, we can face challenges more prepared, navigate changes more smoothly, and ultimately achieve sustainable success. 5. Using information as a weapon. Thomas Shelby is a master at utilizing information as a weapon. For him, information is not just data, it's ammunition. His analytical and strategic thinking teaches us that every fragment of information, no matter how small, can be the determinant of success or failure. Shelby has the ability to observe details and capture information overlooked by others. This reminds us to always be alert and attentive to details around us, to listen more than we speak, and to observe more than we see. He doesn't just gather information, but also analyzes it to understand motives, weaknesses, and opportunities. This emphasizes the need for critical thinking about the information we receive, looking for hidden meanings, connecting the dots, and analyzing the implications. Thomas Shelby uses the information acquired to plan his strategy. In the context of our lives, this means making informed and strategic decisions in our careers, interpersonal relationships, or finances. His choices are never arbitrary, always based on careful data and analysis. He knows when to hold information tight and when to use it to create surprises. In practice, this means understanding the value of discretion and timing, when to share ideas or information and when to hold them back for maximum effect. A positive example of Shelby's way of thinking could be seen in job negotiations. Taken from his sharp observations, you might notice that a company greatly needs the specific skills you possess. With in-depth analysis, you assess how those skills could boost your value. Using an information-based strategy, you formulate your proposition to negotiate for a better position or salary, and then use secrecy and surprise to present your proposal at the right time perhaps after you witness the company securing a major project that requires your skills. In a world increasingly dominated by information, emulating Thomas Shelby's way of thinking teaches us to embrace the power of information, analyzing it, understanding it, and using it to advance our positions in life. Thomas Shelby's thinking technique reflects a combination of cleverness, courage, and careful planning, making him one of the most iconic and admired characters in the Peaky Blinders series. Of course, it's important to remember that Shelby is a fictional character and the methods he uses often involve morally and legally questionable actions. However, in terms of strategy and mentality, there are many valuable lessons to be learned from his way of thinking and acting. Six. Idealism. 
Thomas Shelby is a captivating figure with his unique way of thinking. One of them, idealism, but not just any idealism. He has a careful way of combining idealism with the harsh reality he faces. It's not just about dreaming big, but also about making those dreams a reality. Thomas always has a clear vision of what he wants, whether for his business or his family. In our own lives, it's important to have a clear vision of what we want to achieve. This can range from career, education, to personal relationships. Thomas Shelby doesn't know how to give up. He sees obstacles as steps forward, not as barriers. In applying idealism, we also have to be prepared to face challenges with courage. That means, when we have goals or dreams, we shouldn't easily give up when faced with difficulties. He makes decisions based on long-term values and goals, not just short-term gains. This teaches us not to be tempted by short-term gains that could disrupt the achievement of our dreams or big visions. Thomas knows the importance of community and family. He always embraces them in his struggles. For us, it means recognizing the importance of support from family, friends and the community in achieving our idealism. We can't do it alone. Imagine you want to build an innovative startup. Clear vision, yes, with a positive social impact. Challenges will surely arise, but you must remember the perseverance principle of Thomas Shelby. Take time to plan your strategy and don't forget to build a solid network. This way, you will not only succeed professionally, but also make a real contribution to the community. So Thomas Shelby's way of thinking about idealism teaches us not only to dream, but also to act in a measured and impactful way. It's about combining big vision with reality and never losing hope or courage to make those dreams come true. Let's take inspiration and apply it in all aspects of our lives. Who knows, we could be the heroes in our own stories. Andy Seven, Bold Risk Taking It's not just about being brave, but he has an analytical way of making those decisions, combining sharp intuition with careful calculation. The key is how he considers risks and opportunities, a principle that we can apply in our daily lives. Take, for example, in our careers. Many of us may hesitate to switch to a new job or start our own business. Adopting Shelby's way of thinking means fully understanding the risks involved, but also not being afraid to step forward if the potential gains are much greater. This means doing research, planning strategies, and being prepared for all possibilities. In personal relationships, taking bold risks can mean opening up to new people or trying to improve strained relationships. Like Shelby, we must be able to assess whether this step is worth it. Does the benefit, emotionally or spiritually, outweigh the potential heartache or disappointment? In essence, applying Shelby's way of thinking in real life is about combining courage with thoughtful consideration. It's about not being afraid to jump, as long as we have measured the depth of the water. It's about facing the world with an unwavering spirit, yet always guided by logical thinking and sharp intuition. Like Shelby, daring to take risks to achieve what we want, a life philosophy that can take us to places we never imagined before. So, is it clear now? Thinking like Thomas Shelby is not just about being fearless, but about daring to take risks with a clear head. It's about combining courage with intelligence, taking control of our decisions, even in the midst of uncertainty. So, let's take inspiration from Shelby. We all have Peaky Blenders moments in our lives, situations that demand we step out of our comfort zone and bet on ourselves. Remember, success is not about avoiding falling, but about learning how to rise stronger every time we fall. Let Shelby's analysis and courage remind us that every risk faced with preparation can be a step towards new heights we never imagined. So, what risk will you take today? What's your Peaky Blinders moment? Take a deep breath, make your plan, and step forward with confidence. Like Shelby, we all have the power to turn risks into opportunities. Let's make our moves boldly and see where they take us. Seize the day, my friend. Thank you.